Hey guys, it's Victoria back with another spoiler free movie reaction. And today's movie reaction will be on No One Will Save You, which is currently streaming on Hulu. The film starring Caitlin Deaver and directed by Brian Duffield is about a young woman whose secluded life in her childhood home gets interrupted by an invading alien species. So what can I say about this one? I can honestly say that the concept alone was very intriguing and definitely creative in my opinion. It was like almost kind of like if you put Alien and I Am Legend and maybe The Last of Us and then just smush them together in a way. That's how this movie felt to me. But also it was more than just that. It also has a lot of themes when it comes to dealing with grief, confronting the ugly parts of your life or yourself, and confronting it head on, even if it is through a alien species or whatnot. <laughs> and for a film that has very little dialogue in it, I felt like there was a lot that you could get out of it just by watching what Caitlin Deaver's character is going through, Bren, her name is Bren in the film, and just seeing her go through her journey of trying to figure out a way to ex evade this home invasion that just suddenly came down upon her and on Earth. As far as Caitlin Deaver's performance, and if you don't recognize her. She has been in many things throughout the years, but it's something that you may know her from is Book Smart. Um, she was also in Detroit and and Dope Sick, which I think is also on Hulu, which I highly recommend you check out. And but in this movie, she has she is really showing her acting chops. I really think that she is improving. And also on top of that, she just is managing pretty much on her own. It's like there's not many other humans that are people <laughs> that her character is in contact with or interacting with, really none at all. So the most contact that she does have are with the alien species that she is dealing with. And she really does a good job in this. I really enjoyed her performance. As far as the designs of the aliens themselves, the the alien creatures that in this film, at first when you see them, they don't seem like anything really to write home about. They seem like the typical looking alien with the big head and the skinny body. But when you start to see how certain aliens move or like how long their hands or or nails are or even just seeing how they move is definitely something that you kind of like I would not have imagined an alien doing all of that <laughs> but, and, but in this movie they do I think the director really had a interesting um vision of how he wanted these aliens to interact and and move and and also how they communicate. I think he really thought out how he wanted them to be and he didn't just want it to seem like the typical, oh my God, did I just do the quotes? <laughs> Not typical aliens whatsoever. These aliens are definitely something if not out of the wazoo, they look like something you know, but in reality, there's so much more to them than that. So I'm just gonna be brief with you. I think this movie was very amazing and really it didn't have to have so much for you to enjoy it or at least for me to enjoy it. I found so many different things in the film that I found more than just interesting. I found it sometimes alluring and then sometimes kind of just saddening and then other times uplifting and so I really think that it if I have to give this a rating on a scale of one to ten I would have to give this movie a I give it a eight point 
six. Yes, that's my final rating with that because I think that this film is definitely worth watching, worth your time, and definitely something that you don't have to, you know, go to the movies to see. You can stream it right now on Hulu. And so I highly recommend you take a look at this one because there is a lot that you can take away from it. Even, like I said, with no words at all, just actions and and action sequences and and aliens <laughs> however it's nothing like et so i was happy for that if you like this video please like share and subscribe and yes i know i have been away for a bit i'm sorry it took so long to get this video out there and as you can see i just came home from work so this is the time that i had to film this so i was trying to get to it as soon as i can and also as far as any new movie reactions coming up yes there will be some new movie reactions that i plan on doing soon i'm definitely gonna do one on killers of the flower moon and also um five nights at freddy's i know i mentioned that i was gonna do one on uh the musical dicks but i at, sadly at the moment cannot find a place to see that movie so if i if i do find a place i will definitely let you guys know officially that i'm gonna do a movie reaction on that one and if i can't find it well then please forgive me i'll have to re I'll have to do a reaction on it another time, like when it hits streaming or whatnot. But um, just be looking forward to my next two movie reactions coming up. And also I plan to do a new segment coming up, which I will explain more about it in my next movie reaction at the end of my next movie reaction. So, so look forward to that. Hope you guys have a wonderful and blessed day, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.